Four doors, four seats, eight cylinders. Up to this point, others may even have been able to keep up, but this Panamera joins the long line of Porsche turbo models with boosted power, as well as including an extensive suite of equipment as standard. The Panamera Turbo uses the seven-speed PDK, Porsche Doppelkupplung, which is essentially two gearboxes in one and thus requires two clutches. With two separate input shafts, one inside the other, the flow of power is only ever transmitted through one half of the gearbox, with the other pre-selecting the next gear for quick and smooth gear changes. Porsche believed that form should follow function. Nothing else would make sense. The front, shoulders, and rear all have instantly recognizable Porsche traits. Particularly striking are the side air outlets behind the front wheels, paying homage to the Carrera GT.
Local EMPs are authorized for use. Engineering the future of speed enforcement. Using an explosive pumped flux compression generator to fire military grade electromagnetic blast two times faster than currently deployed technology. This unit is taking our existing NNEMP generator technology to the next level. The first Corvette was designed by Hurley Earl in 1953 and was named after a small maneuverable warship. The Z06, first introduced in 2005, is from the sixth generation and is the performance model featuring an improved larger engine and an aluminum frame. Featuring lightweight titanium intake valves and connecting rods in its 7.0-liter aluminum block V8 and technologies gleaned from the Corvette Racing Factory program, class winner in six out of the last 10 years at the prestigious 24 Hours of Le Mans, the Z06 is the lightest Corvette of them all. The sixth generation Corvettes are the first to have exposed headlamps since 1962. Officers in pursuit of a green Lamborghini on West Beach Freeway. Confirmed suspect reported fleeing the scene of a robbery at the Hudson Tech plant. Affirmative officer, interceptor assistance is on route to your location. Interceptor units on scene, standing down. Interceptor, multiple EMP units were stolen in the raid. Proceed with caution.
600 horses don't slither. The Dodge Viper has always been the big gun of American muscle when it comes to engine size and raw power. With SRT in its name, the Dodge Viper SRT10 also guarantees balanced performance and benchmark braking. Street and Racing Technology, SRT, worked with McLaren Performance Technologies and Ricardo Corporation to develop an 8.4-liter V10 with more efficient breathing and a higher engine speed. To handle the increased torque, a smaller diameter twin disc clutch and the latest evolution 6-speed Tremec T56 manual transmission were also required. A noticeably larger and more efficient hood scoop and venting can be seen on this iteration of the Viper, which helps to cool the new larger engine. This car has all the classic Viper detailing with its crosshair grille, deep cut sides and swept back fenders.
spike strip. Suspect has missed the spike strip. Better luck next time. Over. Kuntash is an exclamation of astonishment that a man from Piedmont, Northern Italy, might make when seeing an extremely beautiful woman. Allegedly, this was the word that Nuccio Bertoni uttered when he first saw the design and the name stuck. A single prototype was built and shown at the 1971 Geneva Motor Show. The first Kuntash, with a few necessary design modifications, including much larger air intakes in the car's rear shoulders, was delivered in 1974. Although not the first wedge-shaped car design, it is undoubtedly the most famous and was the must-have pinup car of the 80s. A total of 676 Kuntash LP 5000 QVs were built between 1985 and 1988, with the Kuntash being replaced by the Diablo in 1990. Improvements to the engine were made throughout the Kuntash's lifetime. With the LP 5000 QV, the V12 engine received four valves per cylinder, hence the QV, quattro valvole name and an increase in engine capacity to 5.2 liters. The six double carburetors were moved from the side to the top, which improved engine breathing, but reduced rear visibility to near zero.
The original Gallardo is the most successful Lamborghini of all time, with 7,100 being sold. The new Gallardo LP564 has a more powerful engine and is 20 kilograms lighter, resulting in an increased performance without an increase in emissions. Traction has also been increased over its predecessor, thanks to improvements to the four-wheel drive transmission, suspension, and aerodynamics. A smooth underbody and rear diffuser helps to suck the car onto the road at higher speeds. The new Lamborghini Gallardo LP564 is a master at taking corners fast. An optimized weight distribution of 57% to the rear was achieved by placing the engine lengthways, hence the LP, longitudinal posteriore in the model description. Suspect sighted on Fox Blair Pass driving a Ford Shelby GT500 erratically. Engage in pursuit. Command Central has approved SCPD airborne assistance. Use the aerial support unit to keep your target from escaping.
seductively powerful and exquisitely finished, the Aston Martin DBS is the ultimate blend of refined performance and minimalist luxury. Representing a milestone of Aston Martin's technological abilities and car design, it is an open invitation to drive, the supreme temptation. Truly great luxury sports cars are rare. In a world often diminished by mediocrity, genuine design innovation and engineering accomplishment are available only to the discerning few. With its race car roots and luxury appointments, the Aston Martin DBS is just such a car. One of the most potent production Aston Martin's ever made, the DBS represents the synthesis of raw power, race bear technology, and design excellence. Powered by a hand-built V12 engine producing 380 kilowatts, it delivers breathtaking power and performance. Like a well-toned athlete in a figure-hugging suit, the aluminum and carbon fiber bodywork of the DBS is a tight wrapping on the muscle that lies beneath, expressed in the taut lines and heavily sculpted flanks. Using technology developed in competition, the DBS is a direct descendant of the DBR9, a thoroughbred race car that has won many of the world's greatest GT endurance race titles. Most notably, back-to-back -back GT1 class honors at the coveted Le Mans 24 hours in 2007 and 2008. Carbon ceramic brakes and adaptive suspension that adjust to virtually every situation ensure that the DBS is perfectly at home in the city, on the open road, or on the track. situation on Grand Ocean Road. Caution advised. Suspect identified as escape convict 212. It's hard to say what sets pulses racing the most. The performance or the looks? The new Mercedes-Benz SLS AMG features a distinctively pure design, superior dynamics, and levels of safety and everyday practicality that are the hallmarks of Mercedes-Benz. The conversion to dry sump lubrication allows a significantly lower engine mounting position, with the resulting lower center of gravity enabling high lateral acceleration and scintillating vehicle dynamics. Power is distributed from the AMG 6.3 liter V8 to the rear axle via a particularly light carbon drive shaft, similar to those used in DTM C-Class touring race cars. 
With its unique gullwing doors, the SLS AMG is a classic of tomorrow, which takes cues from the legends of Mercedes-Benz. A long wheelbase and bonnet combined with a wide track and large wheels creates proportions that are unmistakably super sports. All units, officers require assistance on Coral Bay Drive. All units, respond. This is an emergency situation. Oh. 